Hello and good morning. This is a new video. Real quick, all of these clips that you'll see today is scattered from September to today's date, which is currently December 17th. Uh, there's been a lot of life things that I wasn't able to play so much. Everything has been scattered. But if you're curious about what date uh, something happened, you can always check on, on the screen. I do have my little eight tracker on the screen right, right now it's on the bottom left but it does get moved around a lot 17th of december 2023 um i was just very busy uh these past few months so i didn't get to play so the structure of this video is pretty terrible but thank you very much for watching here you go all right let's start off today with collecting my resources um i started september 1st it's currently september 24th i cannot be bothered i'm waiting the next few days for the end of the month for the full you know month's time period i don't know what i want to put my things on i kind of want to do teaks and mining but i feel like instead of mining i should go into uh herb lore just so i can have enough teaks and hardwoods to basically level up my construction just for this one time i believe so we're gonna go with that and collect 6k teaks kind of why wiggity wiggity whack or some base herbs that are kind of kind of booty cheeks 93 magic enchant zenite jewelry 77 fletching 87 wood cutting. Sorry if the screen looks a little funny. I had to adjust it. But um, yeah, just AFK wood cutting. Okay, I did not expect this, but I got 97 strength from fishing. Oh, that gives me a combat level. Oh, nice. Go out to the clan. Man, I wasn't recording because I'm a little sick, but I got the magic fang. Oh, yes, dude. Oh, yes. Spoon. 36 KC. Oh. So good. <laughs> yes. Got this recording for 87 mining. Uh there was a star mine here. Uh like I could turn off entity hider. There's still a bunch of people here. But it just died and I was so close to the level. I decided to mine this iron ore. So get a little more XP. Um I feel so dirty every time I spend like so long at a a star. It feels kind of unethical, but it's in the game, and as far as I know, all these people are doing it. It seems legal, so I'm going to continue doing it. Ladies and gents, we are in Priftinus. There's a few things, a few reasons why people go to Priftinus. One is to high alk like this guy, this GIM. One is to blow glass. And agility, actually. I should actually do that, you know. But one thing that I'm here for is to try to learn the gauntlet. I've never done Gauntlet, never done Corrupted Gauntlet. Here is my reason why. I've unlocked Priftinus a long time ago. I could have rushed this at the start of the account and go for the Bofa, the Blade of Saldor, Crystal Armor, all the GP that you'll make along the way. And I'll even have that certificate to complain on Reddit that I'm dry, even though I'm only like 2k C in, you know? But... The reason why I haven't tried it is because it reminds me, like watching streamers do it, YouTubers, whatever, like it reminds me of Dungeoneering. And Dungeoneering from RS3 is my least favorite skill. I hate it way more than Old School Slayer. But I'm going to try it. It's, it's something that I can't really ignore. And I'm not doing Chambers to try to get a Tebow. Um, I am doing Toa, but I'm not as efficient as most people, you know. The Bofa would make it efficient. And if we, again, look at my collection log here. Gauntlet, zero kills. Yeah, I wasn't even planning on doing this. But honestly, that regular Gauntlet KC is going to be pretty high. Because I honestly think this is going to be hard. Look at my stats here. Not even 99 range. I get told that you want a like, high prayer level. I only have 77. Max range and mage and stuff like that. I've never seen a guide on Corrupted Gauntlet. Off of just glancing on my second monitor, watching, you know, someone on Twitch do the gauntlet, you know, I'm going to go ahead, try it out. Hope I don't have to delete this video because I just will regret it, but we'll see.
I got the wrong view. Ah. There. I got this thing. Ah, what'd I do? Ah, <laughs> I'm bad. I don't know what I just did, but I just finished my first Corrupted Gauntlet. I had the wrong setup. Um. Cool, anything good? Oh, garbage. What did I get, actually? Oh, I get an extra roll. Battle staffs, laws, natures, crystal shards. Okay, that's fine. Um, I did a few normals here. So look here. Collection log. The gauntlet. 24 normals. I kind of got the hang of it. You get two weapon seeds, which is whatever, you know, crystal halberd. I was also told that if I go super dry on enhanced weapon and crystal seed, I could still run the crystal armor set with regular crystal bow. And it'll still be better than my current setup with my crossbow, rune crossbow. So anything's better than that rune crossbow. Uh, it's a shame that it has a really cool cosmetic with the leagues thing. I didn't get anything as expected. Well, I'm not sure if I actually showed this. I did get like these crystal armor seeds or weapon seeds. Hold on. Not the armor one. Crystal weapon. Here, I got three of these guys. One from the quest and two from here. If I really quickly shift this over. That's what I got. I didn't get 44 KC. Remember, these still counts attempts when you at least try to get to the hunt lift and get him, get him down a little bit. So if we take a look at my log here, I can actually show you the completions. Um, 24 regulars, you know, try to get the hang of it. I kind of did, and I only got four of those uh, corrupted gauntlets, and I think I died like 17 times or something doing the corrupted gauntlet. Let me uh, go back and check here. If we check the board, we are at 14 deaths at the Corrupted, 3 deaths on the Normal. Um, yeah, it's not a good ratio here, but again, I'm still learning. Uh, my stats are not that great at all for Corrupted Gauntlet, at least. I don't know if I want to just keep spamming for the regular Gauntlet. Uh, that'll be pretty good. Uh, another big reason why I'm doing this is because it shits out crazy amount of runes, you know? Like rune play bodies and stuff like that, alcables. And I need to train my crafting somehow. I need to train my construction somehow. You know, the GP, GP heavy skills. So uh, I am not I I had fun in the regular one, the but corrupted gauntlet did not seem fun at all. Those extra two minutes lost, it really does matter. All right, there we go. 96 fishing. You can see on the timer below here in the red, been just under an hour. I've been collecting this uh, new uh, pork juice. Uh, it's the new thieving method that all the young kids are doing. <laughs> oh, God. So old. Uh, but we turned them in. It took me about an hour to get this. I like to talk about the squirt juice. Mal. I gained 66k XP. Got me up a level, which is nice. Um, so 66k XP per hour, is that worth it? It was okay, it was annoying. I spent like a good 10 minutes just constantly being caught. It's also like 10.30 in the morning, somewhere around there, my time. So, uh, maybe it's worth it, maybe it's not. I'll try it again. Oh uh, man, I missed the level. Um, here we go. A new HP level. Uh, 98, one level off of 99. Uh, where am I? Where am I? Uh, da, da, da. It should say in the clan. Thank you to those. Bye. It's late as hell. Um, doing some cracking. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh my god, an abyssal head, I guess. What's the freaking... Huh? Hold on. On abyssal head? Ooh, that could be the slayer helmet, right? Yo, about to grind slayer points for this. Alright, I also just searched up the drop rate. This is like a 1 in 6,000. I don't have 6,000 Abyssal Demons kills there, right? So it's pretty spoon. I also don't have an Abyssal Whip. I've been slaying with just a Fang, and I hear that in terms of just normal Slayer, you want to use an Abyssal Whip. Tentacle Whip preferred, but, you know, I'm working on it. You know what I haven't done in a while? Check my Miscellanea. I believe it's been about a month. Maybe a little over. It's a little hiatus, and playing some Leagues. Finally back on the Iron.
But let's go. I have not been raising favor every day, so this is going to suck. I'm not going to get too All right, nice. I still have 1.2 million here. Uh, most of it's going to be into mahoganies. Is that a good idea? Probably not. But let's collect it anyways. Boom. 12k mahoganies. Oh, dang. I was actually supposed to change the maple one. Ah, why did I do that? I'm supposed to put that into herbs. But that's a lot of bird nests. Well, I don't really need seeds though. I already have the 99 farming that I got. Bird's nest, I guess, just for brews. Okay. Um, we're going to start to move it all into herbs now. I believe I should have enough mahogany to get a decent amount of, uh, have a decent amount of construction. So let's still put a little bit more in. I don't think I need any more maples. I could fletch those, but. Eh. I thought I hit the record button, but let's take a look at this. 100th normal raids. Most of them were 150s. Uh, no purple, but battle staffs, you know. I guess I forgot to show this while I'm running to change my spell book. That's my toa log. I have not reset it, so. 139. The thing. The ring. About a total of 59 mil worth of loot with everything else. Uh, the big notable. Ooh, stupid crocodile. The only notable thing here is probably the dragon stones. I did make a lot of them. It's a skill necklaces and glories just so I can high out them. Um, I still keep some in the bank, of course. Uh, that's a lot of recoils, the sapphires, emeralds, uh, rings of dueling. Uh, rubies will be made into dig site uh, pendants, the amulets, whatever. And um, I wish I could turn in these uh, threads for our extra things. I'm not sure if you can. Caches, I don't have the cash loot right now, but I'm pretty sure it wasn't really that crazy good. Uh, 71 Snapdragons, uh, 84 Ranars. The Snaps and Ranars are kind of what I'm really aiming for. The Toad Stoles are okay. Same with the Toad Flax. A lot of my Toad Flax are coming from here. Uh, battle Staffs are the Alcabols, Gold Bars, kind of useless. But overall, I really do love Toa, so I hope to do it more and have better gear to do it but faster and efficient. Ninety nine strength, ayo. One one seven combat level. Nice, 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 nice. T Y to the clan. T Y T Y. Wow, my first ever combat ninety nine of out of the entirety of RuneScape, or in old school RuneScape. Uh, let's go get this cape. Uh, I just noticed I don't have coins on me, but should be at the Warriors Guild. It's sold here, right? I'm not crazy. Who has it? I don't even know who has it. There's the attack guy. Oh, don't, don't tell me I have to search this up. Where is this guy? There he is. Aha! Hello, Mr. Strongman. Uh, can I buy a skill cape from you, please? Awesome. Fucking amazing. I used to always see this um, emote all the time. I believe Strength is one of the more popular 99s. Um, really cool. I love it. Pretty cool. I'm really excited. Here we go. 76 Hunter. Uh, the reason why that is important, because I got... 2k total pretty nice pretty nice um honestly i'm a lot like very far behind than i hope for thank you to the clan ty ty